honesty. You did put North Carolina. I don't know what county you're in, right? And I don't know what line of credit, what type of line of credit you're looking for, but I'm just gonna look for banks that offer both. So credit unions in North, same standard of measurement. When I hit the bank's website, I'm looking for home equity line of credit. I'm looking for personal loan, and that's where I'll find personal line of credit. So they lend up to 9%, 1%, of the principal balance will be your payment. You require a property appraisal. All right, they did not display their rates, but let's see if they showed over here at the bottom. Don't see the HELOC. So that was your community credit union. Let's go to members credit union. Let's check them out, see what they got. All I'm doing is seeing if they offer a HELOC and or P boom, personal loan line of credit. So they go up to 15K. So they got PLOCs at 15K, but we don't know what the rate is, we might reveal it here, 14.25%, too high in my opinion. And they did also have, they had a home equity loan, but do they have a home equity line? They do have a home equity line credit up to 100K, 15 year. All right, so that's members credit union, Misty. Hopefully you're still with us. Let's go back. Welcome Federal Credit Union, it's in North Carolina, up to 100%. LTV, those are those tend to be fun. Bar as you go, no closing costs. Cool, cool, cool. Let's see how they do their rate. So we know they offer a HELOC at Welcome Federal Credit Union, but we don't know what the rate is. When they don't display it, that means we have to call and ask. If they say we need to run your credit, then you would respond and simply say, what is the typical credit range at the different credit scores that you typically see. So at Welcome Federal Credit Union, they have a PLOC from one to 25,000 bucks. Again, we don't know what the rate is. We'd have to call and ask, but that's Welcome Federal Credit Union. Let's do Summit. I've heard of Summit before. I've had quite a few clients work with Summit. So I know they offer personal loans line of credit. They do 20K. Uh, let's see. Let's look at their home equity line of credit. Let's see what they offer. View rate. So they offer a uh, home equity line of credit 7.75%. That's attractive, folks. In 2024, that's worth taking a look at if you're in North Carolina. Okay, so that's Summit. Hopefully this is valuable for you, Misty. If you're still with us. Uh, let's see. Denzel, what are your thoughts on U.S. Bank, Key Bank, PNC, PenFed? Would those even be worth considering only if you can beat 10%, Michael? So what, so what you're doing now, Michael, is you're following my, my advice. So we just we looked at pretty much the whole area of Cle Cleveland, Ohio, right? And all we found was Steel Value Credit Union at 10%. When, it, when we are having limited options for what we're looking for, then I say, yeah, go statewide, go federal and nationwide, and we're looking for banks that service Ohio. As long as that bank services the state of Ohio, then we can put that on the list. So if U.S. Bank, Key Bank, PNC, Penn Fed offer PLOCs, which I know some of them do, I don't know if all of them do, but I know some of them do offer PLOCs, now it's just a matter of figuring out if their rate is below 10%. First Carolina People's Credit Union. Let's see what they got. Overdraft line of credit. Probably not going to be as attractive. Go to home loans. Whenever you don't see home equity, it'll typically be under home loan. But this bank does not look like they offer a HELOC. Right, but that's typically what it is. So you gotta do a little bit of digging. Coastal Credit Union, let's take a look. Home equity line of credit, 100% LTV. Ooh, nice. 8.1% up to 250. If you take a minimum draw at 15, you'll enjoy a 0.25% discount. So instead of 8.1, maybe it's a 7.85. The higher you go on the LTV, the higher the rate is. The lower you go on the LTV, the lower the rate is. That's typically what I will see. So the more equity you have in the home, that's another factor that helps you get lower rates. On your HELOC so always pay attention to that as well it's a nice little tip there so coastal credit union brag mutual federal credit union personal loan unsecured line of credit so they do have a PLOC let's view their rates unsecured 14% ouch only up to 10 not a track but do they have under home equity loan let's see if they we can find home equity line I don't see that they have a home equity line so we'll get out of here brag can't do it for me. Heard of Civic Credit? A little bit better, but eh. And then we're looking for home equity line. As low as 8.5, 15 year draw, up to 250. 
Not bad, not bad. 90% LTV, not too bad. They cover North Carolina, South Carolina, Virginia, and Georgia. Traditional. So here's another advantage that you will typically see with PLOX is if you go with the principal and interest payment, you may also see a lower interest rate. If you just go with an interest only HELOC, you will tend to see a higher rate. So that is another nice little tip there that a lot of people miss. Was this valuable? If I did more live streams where I just did that, would that be worth it? Like you just spend 30 minutes with me on a live stream, 45 minutes, and we just go state by state. Would that be valuable? Let me know in the comments because we're getting ready to close out here. So action steps, your research in banks, you're gonna wanna go to the playlist all about the line of credit on my channel. Click on the playlist, Velocity Banking Pregame Work. Let's determine if this is actually right for you. And if it is, let's get geared up to actually do it full force. To work with me one-to-one, -one, let's jump on a call. Let's start with its consultation. Typically, most people start out with an initial financial coaching session or consultation. We're just looking at the numbers, we're building a plan. And then from there, typically after one to two phone calls, people work with me on a longer term basis, right?